Hi everyone. My kids are out of school, so summer is in full swing and it is a little crazy around here. I wanted to take a minute and go over our yard sale finds for the week along with what sold. We actually had a couple of things that even sold on the same day, so that was exciting. And it's been a good week with the weather warming up. I think more and more people are holding yard sales, so we've had lots more opportunities to be out thrifting and it's been fun. So here is our first item. It was a Nike women's zip up hoodie and I love these. I actually got it for me, but ended up being too big. Sadly, I paid a dollar for it and it will sell for $35. We have good luck with Nike. It's a pretty dependable brand to resell. So we'll see how it does. We found this TI-84 Plus Silver Edition calculator. These always sell really, really well for us all year long. Uh, we paid $55 for this and we have it listed for $55 and usually they sell pretty quickly. We have this hat. Catching Deers is a trendy hunting um, apparel company. My husband is a hunter, so he knows all the hunting stuff. Uh, this we bought for a dollar and it's posted for $25. So we'll see how it does. My husband bought a PlayStation 2 bundle um, this week for $15. It included these controllers, which he has listed for $18 each. He already sold two games for $55 total. And then we have a bunch of other games that it came with. It's a whole stack of stuff. So these would probably sell for five to $10 each, but we're going to just throw it up as an auction, um, on a, as a lot for $20 and we'll see where it goes. We'll report back after it sells and let you know how it did. So Rock Revival tends to do well for us. Um, usually it's the items that have the big embellishments on the pockets is what we look for. We paid $5 each for these. We found two of them. Here's the other one. And they should sell for about $35 to $40 each. So not a bad flip. And then my husband and son were actually just they went fishing or driving home and they saw a yard sale, a random yard sale. I think it was over Memorial Day. And they found these. This was probably our biggest find of the week. It was, I think they paid $15 for both of them. They found two. Here's the other one. And we have them listed for $175 to $200 together. And uh, the Explorer guitar, that's what the type of controller these are. You can see here on the back. Explorer guitar. These are the ones that tend to do really well for us. So we always try and pick these up when we find them. And I think that is everything as far as finds. I will go ahead and show you guys now what we sold this week, including the item that sold in one day. We bought this Loungefly backpack for $25 and we took an offer of $60 plus shipping. We paid $7.50 for this Rainbird sprinkler and it sold for full price at $40 plus shipping. These Burger King Lost World watches actually sold really quickly. We paid $2 total and they sold for $18 total plus shipping. This was a really cool find. It was a Mickey hat that we found for $2 and it sold for $75 plus shipping. This Sims 2 game was part of the PlayStation bundle that I talked about earlier on in the video. We paid $15 for the whole bundle and this game sold for $20 plus free shipping. It sold in one day, so super fast, and it paid for the whole bundle, so everything else from the bundle that we sell from here on out will be profit. 
This Metal Gear Solid game sold for $35 plus free shipping. It also sold in one day and it was also included in that $15 PlayStation bundle. So it's been a great bundle so far and we still have lots to sell from it. We paid $5 for this Let's Go Eevee for Nintendo Switch and it sold for $38 plus free shipping. Last was this KitchenAid that we bought for $50 and ended up selling it locally for $150. I originally had it listed at $225, but it sat for quite a while, so I dropped the price and ended up taking a lower offer. And I was just happy to see it go to a good home with somebody that was really excited to have it. Thanks for tuning in. That's everything that we have for this week. Uh, we found that yard sales are actually starting Friday and Saturday a lot of places. So we're going to try and get out there this Friday and this Saturday. Hopefully find some more good stuff. And I'll be back on to post what we found. So um, let me know what your favorite find of the week was. I would love to hear. And thanks for tuning in. And good luck this week with your thrifting and yard sailing.